Hi, Mark. Hi, I'm Ty. Hi. So I'm going to have you guys scoot a little bit closer in together. All right. And then I'll be here, and then we'll kind of talk in the camera, but I'll probably look at you. Congratulations on The Expanse. Uh, thank you. Thank you. I love the show. It is fascinating. It's so intricate. How do you guys plan? How did you guys plan it out when it has so many different factions? It's on different planets. It's just a lot going on. So, so I wrote these books, <laughs> um, and, and a lot of the planning went in at that early phase. But of course, these guys then have to translate all my, you know, millions of words of, of fiction into something that makes sense on a screen. So that's that's. Yeah. Mostly their job. Well, the world building was tremendous, and, and a lot of times when you adapt stuff, you know, you're figuring a lot out. Th this is the opposite. There's so much there. It's almost, you have to figure out what, what you can fit in, what you can leave out. And, and then they have the novellas, which are the side stories, which all weave into the main books. And so it's an embarrassment of riches, and, and it's really, uh, that's the challenge, is how, how do we get all this in here? It's a lot, and I was watching the last couple of episodes from the previous season, and I was, there's betrayal, I think that those creatures are more intelligent than, than what I had first thought, and it kind of looks like they might be children? Well, I mean, that's certainly one of the central uh, mysteries of the last season is, is who are those creatures, what hap what's happening to those children. Um, we're going we're gonna to explore the rest of that in season three, um, and uh, some of the answers are pretty dark and heartbreaking, but I, I think there's also some upli uplifting stuff coming. Yeah, but we will learn a lot about the proto molecule, and and one of the cool things about the novels is that it's it, it makes you wait for that mystery, and and it's not what you think, and then it's not then a new answer comes and a new question comes, and you're constantly it takes you three books really to fully understand what the thing is that you're chasing, and usually stories want to get get it out there quick, they want to answer questions and the books have a, a and we're trying to preserve this is to let the mystery constantly unfold at its own pace and then when you think it's solved it just unravels another mystery so that's what we're going for I'm not going to break that from the books <laughs> and it looks like they're going to be going to war oh yeah season three is all about war um, you know personal conflict with the crew um, big conflict between the three factions in the solar system um, yeah, this is this is the one where we pay off all the sort of building that we've been doing in the first two seasons. Yeah, last season was pick a side. This season is it's time time to fight, and on all micro level, macro level, on every level. So we've been talking about conflict for a long time, and now it's it's gonna pop. And I was wondering because Bobby, it looks like she's almost switched a side, but it feels like she's more about the morality and decency as opposed to Martians Forever or Earth, but is that what you guys are going to be going for? Well, I mean, I, I think it's very clear that Bobby picked the side of truth. Um, she wants the truth to come out. Uh, it, it, it's not really about politics. It's about getting, getting the correct story out, making sure people understand what's really happening, um, and, and, you know, avoiding the spilling of more innocent blood. Yeah, it's a, it, it comes down to, and Vassarala is getting there too, it's a, a humanity first as opposed to Earth first, Mars first, it's, it's a human race first, can we, can we save, each, save each other and ourselves, you know, that, that's, that's the big revelation that's taken, taken three seasons to get to. Well, I'm looking forward to the upcoming season on Sci-Fi, thank you so much for speaking with thank me. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. Thank you, yeah. bye.